Hello everyone and welcome back to my Tech vs Magic series. Today, I was going to work on the sodium sulfate, sulfide, whatever stuff. I need to figure out what that is. Sodium persulfate, that stuff. But, as you can see, this place has become a traffic hazard as I've added more carts to it. They keep running into each other. So that is what we're going to work on today, is trying to fix that. So I have some holding tracks and some signal block relay, or signal block relay boxes. So we want to first see if we can put track on top of these, which I think you can, but I'm not sure. Yes, okay, good. Then, at every corner, I guess is the right word, we want to put these. is going to be a little bit costly just because this is not a square building and it has those little snake sections like here we have to do this in both buildings and we also have to do it vertically Meaning we're going to need to do something oops, with the track section that's in the middle there. That's that. So something up here as well. And anywhere along here should do. So here. Oops, I should have used silk touch for that. Hmm. Oh right, this needs something underneath it. I don't know why that is, but it does. Okay, there's that one. Now this one. This whole building. Also been a problem with collisions. I've also had trouble with some of the existing setups there. The signal's not changing properly. The um, capacitor signals. I don't know why, but for instance, I think this one here I had to move a few blocks further in for it to start working. Let's see. I need to make this a loop too. So we're not going to have enough of these. So let me make a few more and I will be right back. Okay, I've done that and I extended this to continue a loop. And now then we want to link all of these together. And it does need to be a loop for what I have planned. So the block is not valid. So we missed one here. Hmm. This is not enough to put up to place anyway, so we will straighten this out. To here. Yeah, that'll work. Then we can just make it do this. This should be there, there, 
much complete. Whoops, did I not click this? Just need to find the signal block. Then here. Okay, do not admit the redstone signal. Hmm. Okay, it changed on me. Why is it doing that? It should be something different. think these are all flashing that way so I've done something wrong we'll have to wait and see okay let's just have this always emitting a redstone signal then there Okay, so if we this and that that does improve things. Then here to here. Here, there. I'm hoping that when this is a complete loop, things don't mess up at all. And finally, back to here. Okay, so you should never emit a red cell signal. I think that's the only other one that matters. Now then, are all these red? No. So somehow we need to link this back to that. This way. Okay, I think that's got it. Now then. Okay, so what we need to do is to break these first ones. That one should not emit a redstone signal. Ever. Okay, that was a little spooky. Um, hmm. Do I want to do... I suppose... Keep these lined up. Then here. And is that all of them? There's this one, but we'll wait for that to get back. So, on these, we're going to take some signal controller blocks, boxes, put them... I don't think these do anything on redstone, I hope. Going around. And that. Put the track back on top. Whoops, that's the wrong type of track. Okay. 
Okay, we want holding tracks. Hopefully these don't. Oh yeah, that's going to be a problem. I'll have to fix that. I can do that by... Putting it over there here. You should not be flashing yellow, should you? No, you should not. Hmm, that might be a problem. I have to fix that. Assuming it is actually a problem. So that is finished. Okay, we were here. Yeah, we did those. Did that. Now then we'll take this. We'll just link these starting with the one here. Oh. Hmm? Is this the wrong one? It might be. Yes, this should be a relay. Not a thing about proper darn it. Let me fix that and I'll be right back. I'm also going to put them in the buildings over there. And apparently we undefined all those because we dug up the tracks, that's right. Okay, I've done that in the other building and fixed these so that they're signal receiver boxes. Now then hopefully I can link that with that. And I want these to emit redstone signals on red. No. Don't emit redstone signals on red. And everybody else, you can emit redstone signals. Yes, like that. Or probably should emit redstone signals on green. So the default setting is actually correct. Oops, wrong thing. So we need to link. Right, we have to start at the boxes. We'll just go around. Mm, yeah. Here. And do this to every single one, as long as they each have a link, it doesn't really matter which link it is. So we're here now. And this is also why I want them in a loop. So that it doesn't matter which one I link to. That was that one. So are we here now? I might should turn on or go get the goggles and use those. So that I can see what is what. That was linked, that was linked, that was linked. So here. Yeah, probably. Then I don't need to do this for the other side, so let me do that, and I will be right back. Okay, this is not going to work like this, because this is auto-switching when it's holding right here. So we're going to have to rip up all of this stuff and make all these branches three long, and put the holding track in the second one, and hope that that works. So that's going to take a while, let me do that, and I will be back. 
Okay, I moved them so that there's three. And now then the whole circle's connected. If there's a cart on the track, all the holding tracks are off. Unfortunately, this still doesn't work. What is happening is there are multiple carts getting stuck on these so that when they all switch, more than one cart is getting pushed out onto the track. And that is not good. Uh, maybe if I let it run for a while when I get everything fixed, it would work. But right now it is not. I think I'm going to fiddle with this between episodes. I'm going to try to get everything situated and organized again. And then see if that'll work. If not, we're going to have to come up with something else. Some kind of like shunt track or something. Yeah, I can't think of anything else other than that. I was hoping this would work. But apparently it only works if there's less than one or less than two carts. Going to move at the same time. So I'm going to fiddle with this like I said and in this episode here. If I fix it, I will tell you next episode. Like if you like, subscribe if you're not. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time.